In the heart of our planet, hidden beneath miles of crushing pressure and perpetual darkness, lies a world untouched by sunlight. A world of mystery, where life takes on strange and often terrifying forms. These are the unexplored depths of the ocean, a place where only the bravest dare to venture. Join us now as we plunge into this alien realm, encountering creatures so bizarre, so monstrous, they seem to have sprung from the pages of science fiction. Imagine, if you will, a world devoid of light, a place of perpetual night. Here, in the abyssal plains, survival takes on a new meaning. This is the realm of the anglerfish, a creature that has turned darkness to its advantage. From its head dangles a bioluminescent lure, a beacon in the dark. Unsuspecting prey, drawn to the light, become victims of the anglerfish's lightning-fast reflexes. Its gaping maw, filled with rows of needle-sharp teeth, makes escape impossible. The anglerfish, a testament to the power of adaptation, thrives in a world where light and darkness hold equal sway. For centuries, tales have been told of colossal sea monsters, creatures capable of dragging ships and their crews to watery graves. These stories, passed down through generations, have captivated the imaginations of sailors and land dwellers alike, painting vivid pictures of the unknown lurking beneath the waves. While many dismiss these stories as mere folklore, we now know there is truth to the legend. Modern science and exploration have revealed that the ocean's depths are home to creatures beyond our wildest dreams, validating the fears and fascinations of those who came before us. In the deepest trenches of our oceans, the giant squid lurks. This enigmatic creature, once thought to be a myth, has been confirmed by marine biologists and explorers who have ventured into the abyss. This behemoth, with eyes the size of dinner plates and tentacles that can crush steel, is a true titan of the deep. Its sheer size and power make it one of the most formidable predators in the ocean, capable of taking on even the largest of sea creatures. It is a master of camouflage, its colossal form blending seamlessly with the inky blackness of its surroundings. This ability to disappear into the darkness makes it an even more elusive and mysterious presence in the ocean's depths. Only a fortunate few have ever witnessed this elusive creature in its natural habitat, a testament to the vastness and mystery of our oceans. These rare encounters remind us of how much we have yet to discover and understand about the world beneath the waves, a world that continues to inspire awe and wonder. Time, in the abyssal depths, seems to stand still. Creatures unchanged for millennia still patrol these dark waters, their forms a chilling echo of a prehistoric past. The goblin shark, a living fossil, is one such creature. Its most striking feature, a protruding snout lined with razor-sharp teeth, gives it a nightmarish appearance. But it is the goblin shark's hunting technique that is truly remarkable. With lightning speed, its jaws shoot forward, impaling unsuspecting prey on its teeth. It is a gruesome spectacle, a reminder that even in the depths of the ocean, survival comes at a price. Chapter 4. The Vampire Squid Phantom of the Abyss Imagine a creature so bizarre, so otherworldly, that its discovery sent shockwaves through the scientific community. This creature, with its eerie appearance and mysterious habits, has fascinated scientists and oceanographers alike. This is the vampire squid, a denizen of the deep that seems to defy classification. It inhabits the dark, cold depths of the ocean where few other creatures can survive. Its name, a misnomer, belies its gentle nature. Despite its fearsome moniker, the vampire squid is a peaceful creature. Unlike its namesake, the vampire squid does not feed on blood. Instead, it has adapted to its harsh environment in a unique way. Instead, it subsists on a diet of marine snow, a delicate rain of organic debris that falls from the surface. This detritus provides the vampire squid with the nutrients it needs to survive, a delicate rain of organic debris that falls from the surface. This constant shower of particles is a lifeline for many deep sea creatures. Its most striking feature, a cloak-like web that it can draw over its body gives it an almost supernatural appearance. This web is not just for show, it serves as a defense mechanism against predators. Gives it the appearance of a phantom, a fleeting shadow in the abyss. 
When threatened, the vampire squid can make itself look larger and more intimidating, a fleeting shadow in the abyss. It can also produce bioluminescent displays to confuse and deter attackers, making it a true phantom of the deep. Chapter 5. The Frilled Shark and Eerie Serpent of the Deep. In the murky depths where light struggles to penetrate, the line between myth and reality becomes blurred. The frilled shark with its serpentine body and rows of needle-like teeth seems to embody this eerie realm. Its primitive features, unchanged for millions of years, hark back to a time when the oceans were ruled by monstrous creatures. The frilled shark is a solitary hunter, its elongated body allowing it to slither through narrow crevices in search of prey. Little is known about its behaviour in the wild, adding to its mystique. Chapter 6. The Deep Sea Dragonfish. A fiery dance in the dark. Legends abound of sea serpents, their eyes glowing like hot coals, piercing through the inky blackness of the ocean depths, their bodies wreathed in fire, illuminating the dark waters with an eerie, otherworldly glow. While such tales may be the stuff of folklore, passed down through generations of sailors and storytellers, there is a creature in the deep that seems to embody these mythical beasts. This creature is none other than the deep sea dragonfish. The deep sea dragonfish with its elongated body and rows of bioluminescent photophores creates a mesmerizing spectacle. It puts on a dazzling display in the darkness of the abyss, a true marvel of nature's ingenuity. These lights like miniature lanterns serve a dual purpose, attracting prey and confusing predators. The dragonfish uses this bioluminescence to lure unsuspecting victims into its deadly grasp. The dragonfish, a master of its domain, navigates the pitch-black waters with ease, its glowing photophores lighting the way. It uses light and darkness to its advantage in the struggle for survival, a true testament to the adaptability and resilience of life in the deep sea. In this eternal dance of light and shadow, the dragonfish reigns supreme, a fiery beacon in the dark, mysterious depths of the ocean. Chapter 7. The deep ocean is a realm of scarcity where food is often hard to come by. Creatures that inhabit this unforgiving environment have evolved remarkable adaptations to ensure their survival. The black swallower is a prime example of this evolutionary ingenuity. This bizarre fish is capable of swallowing prey twice its size and ten times its mass. Its stomach, a distensible sack, expands to accommodate its enormous meals. The black swallower, a testament to the resourcefulness of nature, plays a vital role in maintaining the delicate balance of the deep sea ecosystem. Chapter 8 The Fang Tooth Fish A face only a mother could love. In the depths of the ocean, beauty takes on a different form. The Fang Tooth Fish with its oversized head and grotesquely large teeth, is a testament to this unconventional aesthetic. Its fearsome appearance, however, belies a rather timid nature. The fangtooth, despite its menacing teeth, is a scavenger, feeding primarily on dead and decaying matter that falls from the surface. Scientists believe its oversized teeth may help it to grasp onto larger prey items, ensuring a meal in the scarce environment of the deep. Chapter 9. The Barrel Eye Fish, a window to the soul. Imagine a creature with a transparent head, its eyes gazing upwards as if peering into another world. This is the Barrel Eye Fish, a denizen of the deep that seems to defy the laws of nature. Its eyes, highly sensitive to light, are constantly scanning the waters above for the telltale silhouettes of prey. The Barrel Eye's transparent head allows it to collect even the faintest glimmers of light in the otherwise pitch black environment. It is a marvel of evolution, a testament to the ingenuity of nature in the face of adversity. Chapter 10. The Gulper Eel, a living nightmare. Our journey into the abyss has brought us face to face with creatures both bizarre and beautiful, but none are quite as unsettling as the Gulper Eel. Its cavernous mouth, capable of unhinging like that of a snake, seems to defy the laws of nature. This deep-sea denizen is a master of ambush, its expandable stomach allowing it to consume prey much larger than itself. 
The Gulper Eel, a living nightmare for many deep sea creatures, is a stark reminder of the unforgiving nature of this alien world. Otro, the unexplored depths. As we resurface from the abyss, we are left with a profound sense of wonder and a touch of trepidation. The creatures that inhabit this alien realm, with their bizarre adaptations and otherworldly appearances, challenge our understanding of life itself. Yet, they are a vital part of our planet's ecosystem, a testament to the boundless creativity of nature. The deep ocean, a vast and unexplored frontier, holds countless secrets waiting to be discovered. Who knows what other wonders await us in the darkness of the abyss?